CIET NCERT presents audiobook of mathematics for class 5 entitled Math Magic 5 chapter 14 page 187 How big how heavy part 1 Sarika collects things like marbles coins erasers etc she takes some water in a glass and marks the level of water as zero. There is a picture below on the page in which we can see Sarika interacting with a boy. She has a glass of water on a table before her and she has marked the level of water as zero with a pen. Sarika says, If I drop five marbles in this glass, can you guess what will be the level of water? The boy says, I think this much, as he points his finger towards a level in the glass. She drops five marbles in the glass. She marks the new level of water as five marbles. She says, Oh, how did you guess? Do you know the volume of a marble? The boy replies, I just made a guess about how much water will be pushed up by the marbles. How do you find the volume? Sarika tells him, See, each marble pushes up some water, right? That is because it takes up some space, which is its volume. For the teacher, Children will need more exercises to compare the volume of solid bodies by guessing and by informal measurement, that is, using marbles, coins, matchboxes, etc., before they begin to use formal measures such as liters and cubic centimeters. Page 188 Your Measuring Glass Now, make a guess. Do you think the volume of 10 5 rupee coins will be more than that of 10 marbles? Guess the volume of each of these. A ball is nearly dash marbles. An eraser is nearly dash marbles. A lemon is nearly dash marbles. A pencil is nearly dash marbles a potato is nearly dash marbles on the right side of the page we see the picture of a measuring glass we see the markings on the glass from 0 to 35 in intervals of 5 now make your own measuring glass using 35 marbles take a glass of water and mark the level of water as zero. Then put in five marbles and mark the level of water as 5m. Again drop five marbles and mark the level of water as 10m. Likewise make the markings for 15m, 20m, 25m, 30m and 35m. Now, put each thing in the measuring glass and check your guess. Try with different things like a matchbox, a stone, etc. and fill the table. Sarika and the boy still exploring joy by using this measuring glass. After putting the matchbox inside it, Sarika is saying, The matchbox floats. How do I find its volume? The boy replies, Let's fill it with sand or nails. On the side of the page we have a table with two columns. Column 1 heading is Name of the thing. Column 2 heading is Its volume, that is, nearly how many marbles. Rest of the table is blank for you to fill in. For the teacher, Children can paste a paper strip on the glass and mark the level of water using a pen or a pencil. 
The aim is to develop a sense of the concept of volume through examples and hands-on activities without giving a definition of volume. Comparing things on the basis of volume is more abstract than comparison in terms of length or area. Page 189 Which has more volume? We have the picture of Sarika and the boy again on this page. Sarika is asking the boy, Can you tell me the volume of six marbles in milliliters? The boy says, Yes, if we make a measuring bottle. On the table before them, six marbles are lying. In class four, you made a measuring bottle for 250 milliliters. Can you think of ways for making a measuring bottle which can measure 10 milliliters, 20 milliliters, 30 milliliters, all the way up to 60 milliliters? Discuss with your friend. Tariq and Molly made their measuring bottles. Tariq had an injection. He used it to make his measuring bottle. Molly used an empty medicine bottle. On the right side of the page, we have the pictures of Tariq's injection and Molly's empty medicine bottle. Tariq is telling Molly, I took 5 milliliter once in my injection. I filled it twice to mark 10 milliliters on my bottle. To which Molly replies, I used this bottle which measures 10 milliliters to make my measuring bottle. In the picture below, Tariq and Molly are using their own bottles. Molly used her measuring bottle to find the volume of 5 rupee coins. She found that 9 5 rupee coins push up 10 milliliters of water. So you can also use 9 5 rupee coins to make your measuring bottle. Go ahead. Use your measuring bottle to find out A. What is the volume of 6 marbles? Dash milliliters Page 190 B. What is the volume of 16 1 rupee coins? Dash milliliters Now solve these in your mind. C. The volume of 24 marbles is dash milliliters. D. The volume of 32 1 rupee coins dash milliliters. E. Molly puts some 5 rupee coins in the measuring bottle. How many coins has she put in it? If 30 milliliters water is pushed up, dash. If 60 milliliters water is pushed up? Dash. First guess and then use your measuring bottle to find out the volume in milliliters of some other things. There's a table below with two columns. Column 1 for thing, column 2 for its volume in milliliters. An interesting question. Guess how many liters of water your body will push up? How many can fit in? We see a girl holding a small cube in her hand. It's a cube whose sides are one centimeters each. The cube itself is also shown in one of the pictures. This is a cube whose sides are of one centimeter each. See? Your math magic book is one centimeter high. So guess how many such centimeter cubes will take the same space as your math magic book. For the teacher. To make a measuring bottle, make children use a wide-mouthed and transparent bottle so that markings can be made easily. The activity aims to develop measurement skills in children and involves both making and handling apparatus, such as measuring bottle, in the mathematics classroom. Page 191 There's a picture of some students 
who are all busy measuring things and are talking to each other. The first one says, Hey, my math magic book is about dash centimeters long. So, dash centimeter cubes will fit along its length. The second boy says, So, total dash centimeter cubes will fit on the math magic book. One girl replies from the other corner, and it is about dash centimeters wide. So, dash cubes will fit along the width. Now, if all these cubes are arranged in one line, then how long will that line be? Dash centimeters. Practice time. 1. A stage or platform is made with five math magic books. The volume of this stage is the same as dash centimeter cubes. 2. Guess the volume of these things in centimeter cubes. A matchbox is about dash centimeter cubes. A geometry box is about dash centimeter cubes. An eraser is about dash centimeter cubes. How will you check your guess? Discuss. Chapter 14 How Big, How Heavy Part 1 Ends Here Sound Recordists Butelang Lingdo and Mayank Kumar Assistance in Production by Jagbandhu Jana Producer Vimlesh Chaudhary This book was presented to you by C-I-E-T, N-C-E-R-T, New Delhi, India.